What's up, y'all? So this is the Malaysian tropical curly hair I got from in our hair group. I'm just showing you how the package came to me. The packaging was gorgeous. It got a little damp because it was raining in my area. I'm just showing you how it looked when I first got it because I didn't get a chance to show you. They give you this brush that's supposed to define your curls better, which I thought was very nice. It comes with every order. And this is the hair, so stay tuned for more. Hey y'all, what's up? Okay, so this is a review everybody was freaking out on. Okay, so you know I made my um, half wig using this gorgeous Malaysian <laughs> curly hair. Okay, this is still the half wig. But you guys, I will be honest, it was so hard trying to find out a way to get my hair to blend with the half wig. Um, because it was so much hair. So this is still the same half wig I made, but I just... Took some scissors, cut it right down the middle, and I have a U-part. Yes, that's what I did. I super nigger it, super. <laughs> so, uh, this is just a U-part I have here. And this is the only way I figure out how I can get my hair to blend. Let me know if the blend is good or I need to do something else, but... Honestly, I've tried everything. Um, so, um, the only thing that I found out that worked for me, um, all I do was take some hairspray, no spray, just hairspray. I sprayed it on the top and I just like brushed it out. Of course, I flat, lightly flat ironed it. Um, I did flat iron my roots um, because since it is curly hair, I wanted that little natural type look to it. So, I didn't go ahead and flat iron my roots, but I just took it like here. And all I did was like comb it in. And that's just how I've been blending it for the past um, three days now. And for three days, the wig, I haven't took it out or anything like that. Uh, I did have combs in it, but they were too long, so I ended up taking it out. Eight ounces of 20 inch, and they sent me 9, 10, 11, 12. Four ounces of 18 inch. Um, of course, I don't have all the hair in, because as you can see in that half wig video, this hair is humongous, okay? I'm going to show you all the hair I have left over. This is nowhere near 12 ounces in my head. So, that's one thing about the hair I do love about it. You don't have to use... Honestly, I think if you have a tiny head, you can get away with a bundle, in my opinion. But, I always recommend two bundles. So, two bundles... If you have a huge head, you will be so good with two bundles. Seriously. Randomly fast forward and show you all the hair I have left over. I have quite a bit of hair left over and look at my full head okay so this is like a whole nother install right here so I, I'm loving that give you a lot of hair now as you can see I did cut my wefts um not purposely um I ended up cutting it because you know I ended up changing the part or whatever so I took some tracks out um certain places but I didn't purposely cut it like that and um yeah so this is it I'm just gonna show you the back, this is the side of it. And then this is this side. This is it, and I love this hair so much. So I had minimum shedding. Like I said, I did cut my webs, um, but I had minimum shedding. But it seems like the hair comes sealed. Um, if it's if I'm correct me if I'm wrong, company, I mean email me or something. But these webs are pretty sturdy. Okay, they're pretty darn sturdy. Like, as you see, the webs are double drawn, so you can definitely. Split the track down the middle, which I do love. So that's also a plus because it's showing that they give you more than enough hair when you can get a split track. When it comes to the thickness of the weft, it's going to be probably, if you want like a super flat sewing, you probably can't get it with this hair because the wefts are thick. Um, but you get quite a bit of hair 
like on the west itself. So all I did was wash it with Herbal Essences Hello Hydration and Herbal Essences Totally Twisted. And I'm fell in love with Totally Twisted. I've been hearing about it, but I never bought it for some reason. It was on sale, so I went ahead and got it. So that's all I washed this hair with. And then I just let it um, dry, air dry, whatever. Right now, I just sprayed it about 15 minutes ago. So it probably looked a little wet, but I mean, it's drying. It's not damp or anything. It's just how it looks. Also, one thing about this hair I fell in love with, um, after you wash it, the luster goes down a lot. Um, because when you first get it, it's kind of that little weavy shine to it. I can't explain it, but once you wash it, it's like the perfect luster. Like, that's the one thing about Malaysian hair I was worried about, the high luster of it. But if you wash it properly with the right products, then you'll get that perfect luster that you want. Um, the biggest, biggest thing about this company that I fell in love with, they send you so much information in your package. They send you general maintenance of whatever type of hair you get from them. They give you a list of recommended products. I mean, all of this. And I've never got this from any company that I got hair from at all, so... It just shows you caring for the wavy hair, caring for curly, tight curly, kinky curly hair. I mean, they go down the list. It'll take forever trying to read you all this stuff they put in here. And it shows you how to prep your hair for Remy, version extensions, all of this. So I thought this was so, so, so convenient. Because I can't tell you how many times I have to ask a company, can you send me... Um, any information on how to take care of the hair because some version hair don't work well with other like other version hair with certain shampoos like I can't use um, this um, hello hydration on my yaya hair it didn't work so um, but this stuff like this it definitely at night all I do is tie it down with a scarf I haven't found no type of um, Pacific way of wrapping my hair at night with this hair. I just kind of wake up in the morning just wet it and go and make sure I comb My hair down in it. I may put some hair lotion in my natural hair to keep this shine Um, so it'll blend well, but for the most part a lot of people gave me compliments on this hair like left and right like What kind of hair is that? What kind of hair is that? Da, da, da. So I Love it so much because it looks so natural and like I said, this is the only way um I could figure out how to blend it um for now anyway um i may go ahead and curl it myself or something like that later on and i'm gonna go ahead and add some more 20 inch in the back because as you can see it's like short and it's like a long piece because i end up messing up how messing it up when i was trying to take some hair out so tangling i mean only had it for three days so of course you can put your hands right through it the hair is very very soft it's so freaking soft. And as you see in my um, half week video, this hair can get super big too. So I'm looking in the mirror so I can see what I'm doing to my head. And in my opinion, um, Malaysian hair is way more manageable than um, version hair. Because this hair is like, you just have to wet it. Because the curls are so tight and the texture is different. So you don't have to worry about it frizzing up too bad. Plus it depends on what the products you use. Um, I've been using John Frieda Frizz Ease on my hair like once every time I wash it. I only washed it when I put it in and then after I put it in. So I only wash it like twice and then I'll go ahead and put this all over it. Scrunch it up especially like right here where I cut the hair. You need to come like right there and scrunch it up a bit. So, so far so good. Once again this is a U-part wig so I can't take this out. So if you keep asking me you know how is it working for you da da da. I mean... I really can't say because I will take eventually start taking this off at night and storing it, putting it back in, stuff like that. So, um, for the most part, the hair is gorgeous. The curl is so freaking pretty. It's so pretty. So, if you were just wondering how the hair was, this is how it is. Once again, this is just my U part wig. It's still a half wig, but I just cut it down the middle and... Yeah, that's it, and I will have pictures, and like me on Facebook for close-ups, okay? I'll let y'all let them.